So you're looking to pet and grounded. Sorry, I mean you're looking to get pets and grounded. Different thing. Pets allow you to have a cute little companion that carries your crap around for you. They hold an extra 10 inventory slots and they also benefit you in giving different buffs and producing different items. With these pets, you're gonna first need a house for them. The pet house, God, that sounds so weird. It's this thing, not whatever. It's, it's this thing, it's made of mushroom bricks, crow feathers, an acorn shell, and weed stems. The creatures you can tame as pets are the aphid, the gnat, and the weevil. And here's what you need to know about them. Taming an aphid requires you to create plant slurry, which is formed by putting plant fiber through a grinder. You're then going to throw the plant slurry on the ground, which will attract aphids. After they eat a couple, you'll gain them as a pet. The bonus to having the aphid as a pet is the aphid friend buff, which will reduce stamina drain while you sprint. For the gnat, you're going to need spoiled meat slurry in order to tame one. Similar to plant slurry, this is crafted by just putting spoiled meat into a grinder. The benefit of taming one of these is that it's going to increase the glide speed of the dandelion tuft. Finally, for the weevil, you need to drop mushroom slurry. This is made by putting mushrooms into the grinder. The benefit of having a weevil as a pet is that it will reduce your thirst drain rate. You're also able to put little attire on them. The first being little goggles. These are made from three grub hide and they will provide two defense for your pet while also increasing their max health. There are also three variations of the Lil Helm, which all consists of three mite fuzz and then the head of each of the type of three ants. Each of these increase the max health of the pet, but they have different defense levels. For the red helm, you get two defense. For the black helm, four defense. And for the fire helm, six defense. But that's it. Like I said earlier, you do need mushroom bricks to create a pet house. And in order to do that, you need the oven. So you're gonna wanna check out this video that I've done.